Hello everybody, Jo here coming with the Q&A for the week and this week, this past week we've been talking about potential and living life to your, your fullest potential. Are you living life to the fullest? Are you reaching your goals and your dreams and your desires of everything that you want to cre create and do in this life? Or we only have one and we're here for a purpose and that is to you know, design the life that we want and and reach our full potential and do the things that we love to do and be the person we want to be. Um, so have a think about, is there an area of your life that you'd like to improve that you can, you know, do better in and um, be the person that you want to be around, you know, be that happy, uh, fun-loving, creative, um, you know, and, and, a magnetic person that people actually do get attracted to and when we're living in our fullest potential and our true self we are attracting all the good things back to us the people the opportunities all the things that we've talked about over the past weeks that we want to live so the first thing I do when I work with a client is we look at all the different aspects of their life relationships and work, career, money, all of those, spirituality, all of those things and we rate them on um, a scale of 0 to 10 and we look at where they rate so that we can see where the imbalances are and we can work towards um, moving, well moving towards what you really want to create and, um, and balance that out and often there's one area that is really quite low and uh, when we shift that when we when you create the awareness around that and you make the shifts to work towards what you want a lot of the other areas just fall into place naturally um, so we look it gives us a big picture of where is everything's at in your life and then we um, you know work at obliterating those limiting beliefs old patterns of behaviors um, negative emotions and often sabotage you know we're sabotaging ourselves we might get to almost get to that point of conquering what we want to conquer and achieve and then we're unconsciously of course we wouldn't be doing this consciously but we're sabotaging ourselves so that we're now putting ourselves you know in a lower standard I guess um, and also that become that's that, that is a belief, like believing that you can and, and, and really trusting that it is possible. Um, when you move, shift those limiting beliefs and, in, and um, those negative you know, behaviours and patterns of the past, you can actually you know, go full-fledged full forward and create whatever you want in your life. And I do believe you can have the do anything that you want and live a happy, full, abundant life. And when you're doing that, you're actually attracting so much more back to you. When you're living from that space of authenticity, that place of your true self at your full potential, you're actually attracting a lot of, you're a magnet for all that's good. You're a magnet to the people that, you know, people find that attractive. If you ever walked in or seen somebody walk into a room and everybody turns their head, they can see um, they're a magnet, they're confident, they've, they're successful and and you can actually start believing that, you know, and start creating it in your mind what, what you want to feel like, what that feels like to be truly confident and achieving what you want. And that is a really, really powerful way to start um, creating it because you're actually living it in your mind first. Once we create it in here and then we create it, it's created twice, once in here and then in reality. So start looking at you know what area of your life you would like to have more abundance in where you would like to have more happiness more energy whatever it is for you and start with that one thing um, and in my blog this week I've actually put a little exercise where of where you can actually rate those areas of your life so have a look at that and do that exercise because it will give you a bigger picture it will give you a, an idea of where you are and then it gives you a gives you a focus on where you want to be and where you can get to. Um, I truly believe that nobody reaches a 10. 
nobody because there's always room for improvement and I call that never-ending improvement so be honest with yourself if you do that exercise and rate yourself um, according to where you're at so that you've then got a gauge then you've got something to to strive for uh, and and let me know let me know where you're at and what, what areas you're struggling with and let's have a chat let's see um, if we can explore a little bit more about and give you some ideas about how you can change that and you can live your truest potential because that's what you're born here to do that's your purpose to live to your highest potential and do everything that you want to do and everything you want to achieve in your life in this in this life this very short life that we have so reach out I've actually opened up a couple of places to work with people so Go do that exercise and let me know where you're at and let's just do it. Let's just create the life that you want. Okay, so have a beautiful week um, and um, I look forward to speaking to you all soon. Uh, have a beautiful day too. Love to all. Bye for now.